Are there any other moments that you can think of that when you wrote them you were like, eh, this is maybe a little too much, even for this? Oddly enough, uh, one of my proudest moments, the writers and I have this, uh, my excellent writers and I wish they could be here as well uh, today to, for you guys to meet them. Um, it was season one, and it was not uh, as dramatic a moment as some of these others, like Jane dying or, or, or Jesse uh, shooting Gail or whatnot. It was actually uh, season one, and it was uh, the moment when, in, in the fourth episode, when Walt gets this deus ex machina kind mm -hmm. of a, a help from from uh, previously unknown to the viewer, unknown quarters. He, he, uh, we meet Gretchen and Elliot Schwartz. And we realized that uh, Walt used to work with them, and they are very wealthy, and they uh, seem like very nice folks. And they say to Walt, uh, because Skyler intervenes and tells them that Walt has cancer, they say, we're going to pay for your cancer treatment, we're going to give you a job, it's going to be wonderful. Essentially, they throw him a life preserver. And he says, in, in that fourth episode of the series, uh, he says, essentially, he says, no. And he goes instead back to cooking crystal meth. And that was, I think, the moment I'm most proud of in the writer's room, even though at the time it was not nearly as dramatic uh, as some of the, as many of the things that happened since. But it was the moment that we all of us in the writer's room argued a lot and hashed it out amongst ourselves and said, wait a minute, what the hell kind of character is this who would turn this down? Because he's a good guy who's doing a bad thing because for good reasons. But then we realized at that moment, this is a man who's very prideful to a fault. And uh, we really realized, we, we, uh, once we got over our fear of doing it, we, we really realized we had something with his character at that point. That was, I think, uh, my, our proudest moment.